Do y'all have y'all intentions set? Are y'all visualizing? Are y'all ready? Do y'all even know what this day is? Do y'all even know what day it is? Y'all see, I'm wearing my crystal bracelet. I'm just, I'm ready, I'm prepared. If you don't know about July 7th, 2023 or 777, then you really need to watch this video. I am gonna tell y'all how to use this very important astrological date to manifest, to finally bring your manifestations to life, to finally shift into that reality that you've been dreaming of. And make sure you watch the video to the end to get all of the tips. Okay, so just to explain a little bit more, July 7th, 2023 equals 777. Whenever numbers go into sequence, such as 222, 333 or 777 they have an important meaning and an important power so basically this day is like a special portal where the energy will be heightened and it will be a little bit easier for you to harness this power and use this energy in order to get what you want so before we get into the actual tips on how to use this date to manifest my name is brianna b and i make a lot of spiritual content and also other types of content on this channel so make sure you subscribe and like this video also if you're just now getting into the world of spirituality or you just want to have it explained in the simplest way then I have an ebook for you that is always available down in my description box okay so the number one thing that you want to do is you want to set your intentions and really you want to do this every day with everything especially the major decisions in your life but really take this day to get in the habit of setting your intentions so let the universe know what it is that you want what are you trying to manifest just just say it in your head this is going to let the universe know what to put out into your life and it will allow you to have a clear state of mind and not be all over the place you don't want any type of confusing energy in the atmosphere right now because that's just gonna bring things that you don't necessarily want to come into your life so for number two some people don't really have this issue but i would say that this is still necessary because it will just make it easier for things to come through for you that is to keep your vibrations high i know some people don't care about vibrations they don't worry about vibrations but why wouldn't you want to feel good it's better to just do things when you feel better and you get better results. There are many ways to keep your vibrations high and that includes wearing crystals. Um, crystals carry a very high vibration. I know that when I hold my crystals in my hands like this, after like a few seconds, I can feel pulsating. I can feel it pulsating. So that that is a high vibrational item that will affect you as well listening to your favorite songs and i'll do a whole video on this just to go into depth but you know listening to your favorite songs um just being happy and being positive laughing laughing is very important to keep your vibrations high just being in a joking mood just being in a happy and light mood and a light energy this is the one day of all days, of all days, this is the one day that you want to ignore your problems, ignore any issues that you have, ignore any obstacles, ignore anything that's holding you back because it's all gonna disappear once your manifestations come true. Once you decide to make your dreams a reality because you do decide, it's your choice. Don't choose to be a victim, get out of that mentality. It's, and I really, I want to do a whole video about this because people love being victims and the more you fall into that state the more you give the power to whatever it is that you're blaming on your issues rather than taking your power back and literally deciding to know to live the life that you want to live so once you make that choice all the issues will disappear because they're not real and they don't matter number three this is the funnest part of this whole thing um the funnest part of this process and this will help you to keep your vibrations high as well and that is to let your imagination run wild daydreaming is something that got me through a lot of things and just imagining things and then seeing them to come true 
is a wonderful feeling it's like magic it's a magical feeling and all of the good manifestation and spiritual coaches which i am not they will tell you that your imagination is really what's real the 4d is your imagination and that is the reality that you really have the 3d is just a reflection of your reality so you want to visualize as much as you can you want to have like inner conversations one method of manifestation that works for me is having like fake conversations with somebody so imagine that you're talking to somebody and you're telling them that this thing already happened that is something that worked for me really good scripting scripting out your dream life i have a video on that as well scripting is one of my favorite methods too because i like to write um and it just you can just literally visualize and just write a story and just imagine that everything is going perfectly and just i don't know it's just scripting scripting is great go on pinterest look through all of your goals boards look through all of your aesthetic pins go through your whole everything on pinterest and just imagine yourself in those pictures and you just want to repeat this all day like literally don't let okay negative thoughts can come but just ignore them move past them let them pass don't go into the rabbit hole go into the positive rabbit hole don't go into the negative rabbit hole don't spiral in the negative spiral in the positive positive. and the last tip is to just be consistent with all of these things just repeat as i said do this all day stay in the high vibrations continue to visualize continue to script as long as you want or as much as you want have all of the inner conversations and these are just a few manifestation methods which i have an ebook coming out about manifestation methods so stay tuned but these are only a few of the methods that you can use you can use whatever method is best for you but just be persistent in that and just believe your faith and your belief is what holds the power if you notice that anything that people truly believe in it is real for them it becomes true for them when people are deceived or when people fall into cults and things like that they really believed something and it really became real for them like i said at least for this one day and this energy will linger for a couple of days so even if you don't just stay in this energy for one day keep it going for three days and that'll make it even more powerful if it doesn't come true by the next day you'll be very surprised at how powerful this energy really is like astrology is not just for no reason spirituality is not just for no reason it's not just people saying stuff just to say it is not people lying like you know how many how many manifestation success stories there are on the internet like if everybody was lying then i would just be like wow there's there's no way that everybody is lying about their success story if one person or a couple of people can do it then you can do it there's no reason why you can't and also we just had a full moon so we're in full moon energy too so use all of this powerful energy like use it to your advantage it's you won't regret it okay so thank y'all so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe and like this video to get it out to as many people as possible also share if you're willing and thank you again i will see y'all in the next video